what's up? Today I'll be doing a review of the brand new Lego Marvel Super Heroes Spider-Man Homecoming Set ATM Heist Battle. So this is set number 76082. This is recommended for ages 6 to 12 and this consists of 185 pieces. And here's my little brother. Hi. And also over here I got the Beware the Vulture which I'm going to be unboxing after a few days. And I'll be reviewing it. Okay. So here's the ATM Heist Battle Box, and here I just got instruction booklet, and I had the comic book, and the extra pieces of course. And over here it has the all main figures, the robbers are running away, Spider-Man, and all the features, comic book included. And I'll also get to the extra pieces and the other things later, so first I'm going to show you the features. So we also come with three minifigures, Spider-Man and two masked robbers. So first we'll get started with the minifigure. The main reason to buy the set or the Beware the Vulture set is for exclusive minifigures too. So Spidey here, he has a he has so small details than I expected. Plus he has dual molded legs which are really cool. He has painting on his thigh area and on his stuff, dual molded legs. He also has power blast pieces. He also comes with a spare and a set. Also for the beware the vulture set. What you have to do is just press them against the arm. So I'm actually today's my first time trying out the power blast pieces. So so yeah, I'm just gonna like. So yeah, I got this a little bit, but I'll practice it tomorrow. Also, my brother also got toys here. You want to tell them about your toys? Yeah. Okay. Tell. This one like Disney cars. Okay, tell it. Turn like this. Let's see what's that box inside. Light Toad Flights and then Light McQueen. Yeah, Light McQueen. Very right. fun. It's more like that. This is like this big new levels. Yeah, won't you set like this. And like on a laughter. And as you do this, that one's the Light McQueen like this. Bye bye. That's you then. So. So yeah, he said about his toys and also I'm going to continue at the back. There's some more heavily printed torso. There's also what happened with the Civil War last year was that there was actually no black sections on the arms or the back or in the front. So Lego actually improved them and the legs are the same plus the head. And of course, you can use the part of the pieces what? two at the same time if you want. Also... It's a very nice head. The back, the back of the head printing is the same as the comic Spider-Man, but the front is the same. This is the same head from the Captain America Civil War, as I said. And that was Spider-Man, so we're gonna just put it aside and get started with the next mask dropper. So this is the mask dropper who is wearing the Captain America mask. He has this laser gun. It can shoot a bullet. The stud over here is a stud shooter. Also, it comes with this little bar piece. It's just a little that represents the laser. And also, you have this little piece over here. I, this actually looks like a handle. It's actually a handle which is used for buckets in the Lego fan sets. Also, we have the DODC item sticker, and we come with a it comes with a stud on, on the stud shooter if you want to put an extra stud. It does come with extra studs. We have and also, I'm gonna take this out because there is printing. He has plain legs, no printing. He has the he has back printing. The back of the torso has printing. He has that nice texture. The, the printing represents the texture of his jacket. He's wearing a red inner shirt. He has some sort of symbol over here. He also has some pockets. And he he looks like he's wearing a hoodie. Plus he has an alternative face, which is all beaten up. Looks like he has. It looks like he got punched in the face, in the eye, and also he has a missing tooth. So we're just gonna make the robber with the mask side. Plus he comes with a hairpiece. I was looking forward for to get a hairpiece with a minifigure. I'm gonna move this aside. And the last minifigure is. The mask robber is wearing the hook, and this torso piece has been used for other robbers in the Lego City line. Also, he has plain tanned legs, and he has gloves. He's wearing gloves, plain arms. He has belt printing. He has an inner robber shirt. He has some more strap printing. Also, he has pockets up. 
Also in the bag has some more strap painting and that texture here. And he also has a second facial expression. He also can see. I got my which is also beaten up. He has, right. looks like he has a it's bandage like up and a it's little right scratch. Okay. Who like who uh Thomas toys, McDonald toys. He has but the time truck line. That's with the slurs. That's the fire truck like like this on my bike. Let's Sally like this and the bike. Like this. Bye bye. Yeah, that's YouTube. So yeah, that's what he said. Also, he comes with a weapon. It's just a simple purple chain. This actually has a chain. feature. I'll get to that later. And the main gun piece is actually the same piece which is used for Batman's grapple gun. So yeah, I'm just gonna put this aside. And it's just the main set. Now there's a feature built on the front of it itself there's a little knob over here the tactic knob also there's some scratches sticker scratches and you just press this and boom also you can put a minifigure the mask over and then you can just press it and then he falls down so there's a closer look at these stickers they're just three cracked stickers with some slow pieces and I'm just gonna put that up and it came easily because there are three jumper studs and jumper studs or actually like anyway and now also you can open this up there are two ways which you can open it just 90 degrees or the whole thing opens up and I don't recommend hold the to be like this straight I would be, put it like this because in the trailers in the real actual movie the robbers would actually just be walking and then turning there also outside there's a working door and there's a end bank sticker over here. I didn't like. I wanted to line it up, but it didn't work, so I just left it like that. I got. It's my turn. Okay, but it's my turn, Nikki. Okay, he te he told my turn, but I'll just continue. There, these these are the nice tile pieces which were used, and also there are hinges. As you guys, there's a light gray hinge over turn, there Nikki. and a blue hinge over there. Where's my turn? Oh, okay. Like this blaster, cause uh, like blaster, like we gonna like me play a lot. That's my laptop like this blaster gun for my like blaster bike. I just want like this. That's you then. Okay, Bye. so that's what he said. Now it was just a plate use, so you can also put mini figures inside out. You can put all three of them, which is good. And Spider-Man, there's enough space for Spider-Man to come in with his power blast pieces, power blast pieces, but I don't know about this chain. It has to be sticking out of the ATM, but the other weapons, it's okay. It's not that bulky. But anyway, I'm just going to remove Spidey off. And there are two more features, and there's some more stickers over here. Guess what? Bank, 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 they say. I don't know why. And also in the back, it look it looks actually good, a pretty good from the back. And there's a little technic piece. Just press down on it, and so it's not that work, it's not working for me. But also there's some money stacked in there. You can get that out. And the other one is does work. It's actually very strong. So I'm just gonna put my hand. So yeah, and also the money is in there. So it comes with six of these money tile pieces and three in each ATM. So I'm just gonna leave it like that. I will assemble this. And also there's a little clip which which you can use to attach a web. Also you can take one of the mass robbers and then there's a little stud. Spider-Man can just Put them like that. Also, you can on the other side. The other mask robber is ready to go, and uh, the other one. And also, you can close like that, and the other mask robber would just get smushed, and they'll be like, "Hey, let me go, let me go, let me go off here." Also, you can turn them. You can put, put place them like that. You can place them to the side a little bit. There are even little handles for Spider-Man to grab on. And you can, you can place it like that, or you can just make it folded. 
But the real, but I actually like it like that, so I'm just gonna leave it. And I had to clean up this, but I'll clean it up later. Also, adding a nice, to add a new nice New York touch, there's a little fire hydrant. You can take that off easily. Place it back. There's just two sewer studs, and then there's a little cylinder piece cylinder. used. And also, and there's also a little light. Actually, this is supposed to represent a light. And I don't actually know what else to tell about this set. Other than, I'm just going to tell you the other feature. So I'm just going to like clean this up. I'm just going to put some money in here. Three money uh, pieces. So I'm just going to put $300 in there. And yeah, I'm just going to put these right in there. So I'm just I'm going to close this up. And this is actually a great set to get also, but also the Beware the Vulture is also good. So, this feature is recommended for any robber. You can use any one robber, but, but the real thing is you're using the Captain America robber. And so, what you do is just, it's actually, toy. and then it's going to clip him on there. And then he could just take the... Actually, his real weapon is the Hyper Tech Chain, and uh, you just take the HM, which actually pops out, put it like that, and then you can just go yank one of the ATMs out of the ATM, and Spider-Man, before he just goes, you can just take all the money, and then you can tell him you're ready to go, and then he goes, and then he's like, Oh, let's see how much, let's see the $300 bills I got. And then he opens it. And then, oh man, that should be the Spider-Man who took it. Wait, where's my friend? Oh, there you are. And that's, you can make that little funny movie if you want. And I'm just going to detach that and then put back the money. And I don't, they're just $100 bills, there's no... Lego always makes hundred dollar bills. I don't know why. Anyway, I'm just gonna like wait, put that back. Just like this. And there. So I think that covers the set, the whole set. And I don't have any anything else to say about this. Also you can take off the web and then attach it right over there. If you want and Spider-Man can also like you can know, just uh, take all these power bus pieces and you can just grapple on there it's like a little just like that and then you can also take put the web upside down so he can go upside down make it like he's repelling or instead of putting the bad guys you can just like that and then Spider-Man after he just spins up the bad guy he can also be doing the same thing but instead of wrapping himself he will just be relaxing and thinking what to do next and then he just swings off and then woohoo tells 